Hey guys, this is Agent. Welcome to my first ever Let's Play. Um, and by first ever, I mean I've never ever done one of these. I've watched a whole bunch, but never done one myself. Um, today we're going to be playing Terminal Terror, which was released in 1994 by Pie in the Sky. Uh, it's a first person shooter, and the reason I chose the game was because when you do a search for any game on YouTube, you come up with about, with about 50 Let's Plays or something like that. So I wanted something obscure that, that hasn't really been played much. Hopefully it's not too uh, obscure that no one on the face of the earth except for me has played it. But I used to play a lot of games back in the day. Uh, I guess that gives me some sort of bragging rights. Anyways, we're going to jump right into the game. Um, I'm going to go with Joint Mission for easy mode. Because when this game came out I was about 9 or 10. So I don't remember too much about it. Uh, I remember the very basics, but as far as actual gameplay goes, there's bits and pieces of memory left within me. Um, as you can see, it's nothing like Doom or Blakestone or Rise of the Triad. It's kind of plain. The textures are kind of boring, actually. Uh, start the game off with Ninja Kick. Just like that. And I don't know if you guys got to see a picture of the guy that I'm actually playing, but he, he reminds me of... Uh, I think his name is Haggard from Final Fight. Big guy. Um, so Ninja yeah. Kick seems a little strange right off the bat just yeah. because I'm such a big yeah. guy that I don't think yeah. I could do a Ninja Kick. So I like to think that I just borrowed Chuck Norris's leg yeah. and I'm holding it and I just yeah. swing it at people as I go go around. Um, this here's the armory or weaponry. Uh, various guns to choose from. I want this one. The goo gun. And those are bombs. The green things are grenades, which I don't want either of, because what I do remember is throwing isn't all that great in this game. It's very... it seems like slow motion. Um, we can pick up a shotgun. I'm okay with that. And the other weapon's the machine gun, which I don't want. And like I said, you can pick up everything, but space is kind of valuable. Find my shotgun here. This is the target range. Shotgun sounds pretty awesome, for what it's worth. Uh, the goo gun, which is by far my most favoriteest gun in the entire world, because of this reason right here. It looks like flying turds coming out of a barrel. Um, and the sound is even more spectacular. Hopefully this comes through nice and clear for you guys. But yeah, it's that's why it's my most favorite gun ever. Uh, this here is uh, the doctor's office or medical facility, whatever you want to call it. Pick up some first aid kits. This here is the security room, I guess, or comm station. I'll grab this fast. I'm stuck. I'm gonna grab the satellite. Or radar rather. Kinda looks like a satellite. And this here is the general. He's gonna tell us what we need to do. Eddie's Nick. We just got word the terrorists have taken control of an airport where an international criminal named Bruno Riggs was deplaning. It's the guy who wrote the grenade song, Bruno. Uh, or that one guy from the movie. At this point, our agents still have control of him, but it's only a matter of time before the terrorists free him. Since your performance lately has been less than impressive... Thanks! You know, when someone says that, that makes me want to do a great job for them. Uh, anyways, we will send in Major Gaston to deal with Riggs. Your mission is to go in first and save as many civilians from the terrorists as you can. Report to Agent Cooper in the lobby when you need specific instructions. Uh, this guy talks forever. You are ordered to carry out your mission using only non-lethal weapons if possible. Go to the supply area behind my office, pick, so pick some weapons and ammo, or pick up some weapons and ammo, and get some medical kits on your way out. The chopper's waiting for you. Let's get moving, Hunter. Get to the chopper. Well, hello there. Hey, Hunter. 
I thought my name was Nick. Why does everyone keep calling me Hunter? What are you doing here? I've already been given the mission. Face it, rookie. When the brass has to choose between a noodle like you and the capable Major Gaston, the choice is obvious. Anyways, maybe you can help me celebrate the success of my mission tonight? See ya. This guy's a jerk. I just want to kick him. I just poo on him. Yeah. Look at that. Just looks like trails of poo. It's so awesome. Anyway, so here's our here's the chopper. Seems very flat and very small, but anyways, let's get going. Oh. oh my gosh. That helicopter just crashed on that guy. So much for being a non lethal mission. I guess I had like a Japanese pilot on the way in or something. Um I don't even see how I fit in that helicopter to jump out of it. It's the tiniest helicopter ever. Warehouse. Oh. Hello there. Oh, this guy's waving at me. Greetings. Uh, you've got to get the power to the control tower back on or there will be some spectacular air crashes. Get the key to the basement for my brother over there. I overheard their plans to trap you in the entrance to the lobby, so be careful not to go through that door from the brick hub. Okay, thanks. Like my brother said, you gotta flip the basement. You gotta get to the basement to flip the main breaker and then get to the main hub and take the Vader take the Vader the Vader up to the control tower. Here's my key to the steam tunnel door in the cargo storage area. It's awesome. I like how these guys just tell me where to go, like I know, like I've been to this airport a thousand times. Just go down to the storage area, it's down there. Um, hopefully this isn't where I get ambushed. Up. Oh. Well, oh, hello. No. These guys aren't very good at being guards. Oh, look at that, I got two of them in one shot. Oh my gosh, I got three of them in one shot. This is why the gun, the goo gun, is so awesome. Not only do you make mounds of shit out of people, but you can poo on multiple people at the same time. These guys are so slow at drawing their guns, by the way. Um... Okay, gotta find out where to go. Here we go, basement. Usually you go down when you go to a basement, so... Looks like we're on the right track. Uh, items up ahead. Thanks. Oh, oh God! What the hell is that? Bumper cars? Like UFOs in the basement? Where's my shotgun? There we go. Look at these things. How did they get these in the airport? Just like fly them in. They take forever to kill. Good Lord. So we're gonna die. Well, that took forever. It's probably the strangest thing I've seen so far. Bumper cars. Oh god, they're oh my gosh. There's like twenty of those things down there. Yeah, I'm not messing with that. So we're going to go back the other way. And I think we're going to save once we get to the staircase. Um, just so I haven't passed my 10 minutes of YouTube time. Let's see what's this way. Aha! Oh, I need a key. I need a, a gold or yellow key to get through there. 
So we're going to save right here. And we will be right back.